What's up, Vegas? We are back. You have me, the Parker Nelson. I'm sitting here with Pat Daddy. Your boy. Did you guys miss us? I hope so. I know so. Oh, Park, what do we got on the agenda today? Welcome to episode two. Episode two? Well, thanks for turning into episode one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. But today, we're going to talk a little bit about our week that we just had. We had to take your Pat to work day, which was a fun time. What else are we going to go over? I mean, we have to talk about like everything that we did that day, but then also just also giving a little bit of a teaser. Some of the restaurants we're thinking about going to next week when oh, yeah. I take you to work with me. Yep. Bring your park to work day. We're going to reverse the script. and I'm going with Pat to work. Break it down, flip it, and reverse it. But, but before we get into that, uh, we had a question that we asked on the first episode, but now we kind of want to make it a reoccurring question that uh, kind of just becomes our thing. And it's one simple question. Park, how Vegas are you? How Vegas am I? Uh-huh. How Vegas am I? I remember when Wet n Wild used to be on the strip. Okay. Damn. Yeah. That was lit back then, dude. You know who's the one that got away? Who? Going to Wet n Wild on the strip because my mom never took me. Oh. Mom, if you're ever listening to this, what the hell? We're going to have to go to therapy for that one. Yeah. But Parker, do you know how Vegas am I? How Vegas are you, Pat? I remember going to Circus Circus and getting that wristband and flexing it for the following week in middle school. Dude, if you didn't have like three of those by the end of summer, scrubbing. Can you see me a Fright Dome? I don't want to talk. Oh, Fright Dome? Oh, <laughs> dude. Oh, I was just man. thinking about Fright Dome the other day because it's October and I was wondering if they were doing it, but I don't know. No, they don't. They, I think they got rid of it in like 2020 or something like that. I mean, no. before the pandemic, but yeah. I'm looking it up right now. Fright Dome Adventure Dome. Circus Circus, if you're listening to us, Fright Dome was pretty dope. Could you really bring it back for us, like, older people? Yeah. And then introduce alcohol. Ooh, wait, that'd be dangerous. Ooh, maybe? No. To then, I don't know, I was a kid when they went there. I'm sure they had alcohol there. Could you imagine going to Circus Circus drunk now? No. <laughs> well, never mind, I, I, I take that back. I could not, actually. So, bring your Pat's work day. Parker, how was the experience for you bringing a Pat to work day? I thought it was really fun because you got to meet my other friend, Pat. So, we had Patty Cake and Pat Daddy all in one day. <laughs> we had the Pat Clan. <laughs> With the Pat Clan. I thought that was actually kind of fun. And, you know, it was nice to... It's, it's fun to work next to somebody. Yeah. You know? And I feel like I get a lot done in that time. And it's just kind of nice to have someone to talk to at the same time. You know, work's supposed to be fun. It's creative hours. You came to creative hours with me, so that was fun. Um, I've only ever brought Laura, but she's also because her desk is across from me. So she just, <laughs> she bought, she's just there. Yeah. Um, and then, you know, we had a nice lunch. So yeah. it was good to have a talk at lunch, you know. And went to Taco Man. I love that place. <laughs> and you know what? Like, I, I had Taco Man before. But it was leftovers from the one time Laura and friends from New York came into town. Yep. Steph, Natty, if you're listening to this podcast. We love you guys. We love you guys. That birria pizza, that was like already cold, fire still. Right. And then having it in person, like... Fresh. My plot, like, reasonably priced too. That's the best part. Like, how much did we spend? Well, the the, the personal like was like 10 bucks. bucks. Yeah, and then the tacos... I was shook when he said like fourteen bucks, and I was like, "What?" Like, that was a steal, man. I was like, "You'll get some more tacos." <laughs> like, I'm not someone that's gonna get keep like Taco Man. Like, mm-hmm. you guys are fired, man. Plus the big, we got the personal pizza, but if you get the large one, mm-hmm. it's twenty bucks. So if you share it with people, you still get like two or three slices, but like you can split up the cost a little no, bit. I'm keeping that. I'm yeah, keeping it that's what I'm saying. I could eat a whole one of the big ones, dude. Uh I didn't get to take you to, to volleyball, though, but that was kind of chill. No. Nah. Yeah. Because you went off, and uh, you, you did some Raiders things, no? Yeah, I went to uh, the Raiders. They had an event for all season ticket holders. Yeah. Don't worry, guys. I'm not that, like, I don't have that much money. It wasn't me. It was a friend that took me. Really cool experience. A couple of free alcohol-tasting vendors. I didn't get to try them because the lines were too long, and I was, to be honest, I was really lazy to do it. <laughs> but it was really cool. 10 out of 10 experience. Yeah, it was a good time. Came back here. Then got a little creative some more. Worked on some stuff. Talked about some content for the show. And 
Yeah, it was just a good day. It was productive. Yeah, we went up, we went down the rabbit hole of old mob stories. Oh yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna have an episode on mob stories for sure coming up soon. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be good. That'll be good. Yeah. I'm excited for that one. What did you enjoy about the day? Yeah. Honestly, I mean, if I didn't talk about it enough, like the, like Taco Man was like it was just fire, man. I I think it was just cool. Like, uh, what did we get in total? We got tacos de asada, and we got tacos de what was the meat that we had? I am so blanking out on it, but anyways. I just put it in the... I just typed it. Yeah, yeah. The, fire. There was talk, like, the other wild was actually, like, really good. Mm-hmm. But, like, the berry pizza, like, that was just... Yeah. That was just fire. I wanted to go get that tonight. <sighs> it was closed, though. They closed at 10. That's what sucks. Uh, just give us, like, give us till 11. Come on, guys. Make like, Let us make mistakes. Like, let, like, went wild in Las Vegas when it was on the strip. That was the second one I got away. Yeah. Taco Man being open at this time. Oh, <laughs> Oh, uh, no. Oh, no. man. You can even catch the Taco Man video of lunch. The Taco Man video of our lunch. That sounds better? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, yeah, there we go. You can catch the Taco Man video <laughs> lunch on our YouTube channel. All right, we'll have a link for you guys. See them in the comments on our Instagram <laughs> page. The Parker Nelson, two peas and a pod, LV. What is your Instagram name? Pat Daddy, no? Yeah, we got Big Daddy Patty D. Follow me on my personal page. Started up my cooking slash food page, Pat's Only Pans. Man, I love that title. I don't know about you guys, but... Uh, I think it's clever. Yeah, I post like some it. more food content. Uh, start Want to start getting into more cooking and posting some demo videos and stuff like that. So tune into that if you're into some food. And uh, yeah, so Parker, question of the night. Mm-hmm. What are you looking forward to next week when I'm back from Dallas? Oof. When you come back from Dallas... And it's Take Your Parker to Work Day. There's a few things I'm excited about. One, you always go to nice food places. <laughs> like, you're always going to take clients out. I'm like, you know what? I got to I gotta check out one of these places. And that's the only reason I know Morton's, because you take clients there a lot. Oh, man, I love Morton's. I think I shot them out in the first episode, but Morton's, if you guys are listening to this, I love you guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Man. And I like, I want to see Pat and work, you know? Okay. So I want to see what, yeah. Day in the life of Pat. How you, how you treat people. Oh, you know? man. Well, I'm just going to let you know, even though if I have an off day, it's not really off. So we're going to be running out and about. And uh, yeah, some restaurants we can look forward to in the Landry selection. Morton's, of course. You got to make another Morton stop. You can never not go there. You got Trevi, Italian and Caesars. Pretty tasty. They have a mm. nice variety of some food that I, that I at least enjoy. Okay. Ooh, we can even go to Golden Nugget. All the restaurants that are in there ah. are all covered in there. Okay. Uh, maybe even sneak into Vic and Anthony's. Okay. You ever been to Vic and Anthony's? No. Oh, it's a spiritual experience. Yeah? Oh, Oof. Oh, all right. Man, it's sensational. Can we just play hooky and go to all these places? Oh, for sure. Dude. Ah, there we go. Yeah, That's a work day right, for me. <laughs> we'll, get, we'll, get, we'll get our steps in. Yo, you know what slept on, though? Oh, what? The Golden Nugget. Oh, oh my God, for sure. Like, the Golden Nugget is for sure my top three, like, casinos of downtown. Yeah. Like, it's it's still kicking. It's got a good vibe over there. They've yeah. switched to the younger crowd, you know? Dude, the aquarium? The aquarium's crazy. By the pool? Yes. Like, that's dope, man. I remember when that <clears> first <throat> came out. I was in, like, elementary school. Yeah, shit was tough. Yeah, that shit was, that was, that was cool. That was yeah. a cool little spot. We'd always, like, try to stop in it, and the lifeguards get all pissed off. They're like, go! And we're like, <laughs> eyes wide open, like, look at the fish! <laughs> Oh, that reminds me. Uh, a couple of other restaurants. There is a Cadillac Bar has a nice selection of tequila. Okay. Sushi there, red sushi. I've given it uh, a couple chances. I mean, the, the nigiri is pretty tasty. Yeah. If you like sashimi. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I like it. Yeah. We'll, we'll, go, we'll get out and about. I like oh, it. Always got our old faithful mm-hmm. Rainforest Cafe. <laughs> oh, dude. You keep teasing it to me. <laughs> oh, man. Where is Rainforest Cafe now? It's inside Plant Hollywood. 34. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. We got to do Gotta do a oh, Rainforest bro. Cafe day. I'm trying to collect all five of the collectible cups, but and Rainforest Cafe. If you're listening to this, dude, I'm I'm pissed at you guys because all you guys have is either the frog, <laughs> or you either have the iguana. Mm. <laughs> okay, there are three others. There's oh. the Sasquatch. There's the the parrot, and then there's that's all you need to know. All right. Like, oh, that's that's how out of stock it is. That's dang. All right, I'm off my soapbox. I haven't been to Planet, or not Planet Hollywood, but I haven't been to Rainforest Cafe since, like, I was a child, for sure. Dude, I forgot it was still around, I'm not gonna lie. Dude, the first time I ever went was when I started working with Hilton. 
Ah, uh, oh, yeah, so wow, yeah, everyone, okay. Everyone, everyone oh, like, shoot. Yeah. Is it still dope? Oh, dude, for sure, bro. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> the, I got the, <laughs> my first time there, I got the Iggy Piggy sandwich. <laughs> I just, the name just sold me. I was like, the Anaconda pasta, like. <laughs> sold. Give me that sh- Pasta. Like, the Rasta pasta? Whoever came up with those names, man, like. They deserve a raise. You're a celebrity, man. Mm-hmm. All right, well, I'm excited for that. Everyone mm-hmm. can tune into that. It'll be a fun little day. Get to see what a work day is like for someone here in Vegas. Yeah, man. I look forward to that in the future episodes from us. But uh, Parker, I think we're uh, getting near to the end of the episode. So what do we got going on next week? Ooh, man. Next week. Well, what do we have going on? I'll give you uh, a couple hints. There's darts. Okay. On a map. We're going to throw darts at a map. What kind of map? A Vegas map. Yes, sir. So the goal is next week is that we are going to be throwing some darts on the Las Vegas map as we try to find a new place to try in that area. I'm actually really excited for that one. Yeah? Yeah. We need to figure out where we can put darts and... We do need to figure that out. (laughs) I'm thinking... I kind of like the idea of it's on the floor and we just throw it in the air and have it land. Okay. You know, like a little... Okay, yeah. Yeah. I'm down. I'm down. So yeah, we'll be looking at that for next week and then coming up with a couple of topics with the uh, game Would You Rather, coming up with questions and prompts for different things that we can pick in Las Vegas, which we will have our friends answer next week. Okay. I do like that one. That will be a fun one. Well, thank you guys for listening once again. uh, We're going to get a little bit better at this day by day or week by week. We got to the second episode. We got to the second episode. Shit. I mean, I guess we should do a third episode. Yeah, we are. Yeah, let's keep it rolling. Why not? We get a season going. <laughs> uh, All right, stay groovy, Vegas. We do a live. Yeah. <laughs>